Our universe is a place of profound mysteries. From the smallest atom to the largest galaxy, we are surrounded by wonders that challenge our understanding. Nature, in particular, is a master of the unexplained, a realm where the known often blurs with the unknown. It is in these uncharted territories where science is challenged and our curiosity ignited that we truly begin to appreciate the vastness and complexity of our universe. The history of science is replete with tales of phenomena once considered supernatural, only to be later explained by rational inquiry and empirical observation. Yet, even as we continue to unravel nature's secrets, new mysteries emerge, reminding us of the limits of our knowledge and the boundless capacity of the universe to surprise and amaze us. These mysteries, far from being a source of fear or superstition, are an invitation to explore, to question, and to push the boundaries of human understanding. They are a testament to the power of the scientific method, which encourages us to approach the unknown with both skepticism and a sense of wonder. For it is in seeking answers to these enigmas that we often make the most profound discoveries, not only about the world around us, but about ourselves as well, Few natural phenomena captivate the imagination quite like the aurora borealis, also known as the northern lights. The celestial displays of vibrant dancing lights have captivated sky watchers for centuries, inspiring awe, wonder and, in some cases, even fear. For generations, cultures around the world have attributed these ethereal lights to supernatural beings or celestial events of great significance. The scientific explanation for the aurora borealis, while less steeped in mythology, is no less extraordinary. These shimmering curtains of light are the result of charged particles from the sun interacting with Earth's magnetic field. As these particles, carried by solar winds, collide with atoms in our atmosphere, they excite the atoms, causing them to release energy in the form of light. The different colors observed in the aurora borealis are due to the varying types of gas particles present in our atmosphere. For example, the most common color, green, is produced by the excitation of oxygen molecules. The intensity and form of these luminous displays are influenced by the strength of the solar wind, the orientation of Earth's magnetic field, and the composition of our atmosphere. Since their emergence in the late 20th century, crop circles, those intricate patterns that appear mysteriously in fields of grain, have been the subject of intense speculation and debate. Some attribute these formations to extraterrestrial visitors, while others believe they are the result of elaborate hoaxes or natural phenomena. The debate surrounding crop circles highlights the human tendency to seek extraordinary explanations for events that defy easy categorization. While the possibility of extraterrestrial origins cannot be definitively ruled out, the vast majority of crop circles can be explained by more earthly means. Many researchers believe that these patterns are created by individuals or groups using simple tools and techniques. The precision and complexity of some crop circle designs have led some to argue that they are beyond the capabilities of human creators. However, numerous individuals and groups have come forward to claim responsibility for creating crop circles, demonstrating the feasibility of producing such patterns using relatively straightforward methods. These individuals often employ ropes, planks, and other simple tools to flatten the crops, creating the intricate patterns that have captivated the public imagination. While the origins of some crop circles may remain unexplained, the evidence suggests that human ingenuity, rather than extraterrestrial intervention, is the most likely explanation for these enigmatic formations. The animal kingdom is a source of endless fascination filled with creatures that exhibit extraordinary abilities and behaviors that continue to baffle scientists. From the seemingly impossible migrations of birds across continents to the complex communication systems of insects, animals possess a remarkable capacity to navigate and interact with their environment in ways that we are only beginning to understand. Among these behaviors, there are a select few that remain particularly perplexing defying easy explanation and fueling speculation about the true extent of animal intelligence and sensory perception. One such example is the phenomenon of animal migration, particularly in species that travel vast distances with remarkable precision. Birds, for instance, are known to navigate using a combination of celestial cues, Earth's magnetic field, and even olfactory senses, allowing them to return to the same breeding grounds year after year. 
However, the exact mechanisms by which they accomplish this feat, especially in young birds making their first migrations, are still not fully understood. Another intriguing example is the ability of certain animals to seemingly predict natural disasters. There have been numerous anecdotal accounts of animals exhibiting unusual behaviors prior to earthquakes, tsunamis, and other catastrophic events. While the scientific evidence for animal earthquake prediction is still inconclusive, some researchers believe that animals may be able to sense subtle changes in the environment, such as shifts in air pressure or the release of certain gases that precede these events. The human mind is naturally drawn to the unknown, seeking explanations for events that defy easy categorization. In the face of the unexplained, we often turn to speculation, superstition, or even fear to fill the void left by our lack of understanding. However, it is precisely in these moments of uncertainty that the scientific method proves its worth, providing a framework for investigating the unknown and separating fact from fiction. Science, at its core, is a process of inquiry, a systematic approach to understanding the natural world through observation, experimentation, and the formulation of testable hypotheses. When confronted with a mystery, scientists do not shy away from the unknown, but rather embrace it as an opportunity for discovery. They begin by gathering evidence, carefully observing the phenomenon in question, and collecting data that can be analyzed and interpreted. This evidence-based approach, grounded in empirical observation and rigorous analysis, has been instrumental in unraveling some of nature's most enduring mysteries. From the discovery of the laws of motion and gravity to the decoding of the human genome, science has consistently illuminated the shadows of the unknown, revealing a universe far more complex and awe-inspiring than we could have ever imagined. In an age of unprecedented scientific and technological advancement, it is easy to believe that we have solved most of nature's riddles. Yet for all our progress, there remain countless phenomena that continue to elude our understanding reminding us that the universe is far more vast and mysterious than we often realize. These enduring mysteries, far from diminishing our sense of wonder, serve as a constant source of inspiration, driving us to explore new frontiers of knowledge and to question our place in the cosmos. The allure of nature's mysteries lies not in our ignorance, but in our capacity for awe and our innate desire to comprehend the world around us. Each new discovery, each mystery solved, only deepens our appreciation for the complexity and elegance of the natural world, revealing new layers of wonder that we could never have imagined. It is this sense of wonder, this insatiable curiosity, that has fueled human progress for millennia, driving us to explore the farthest reaches of space, to delve into the intricacies of the human brain, and to seek answers to the fundamental questions that have captivated humankind since the dawn of consciousness. So, as we stand at the precipice of a new era of scientific exploration, let us not forget the importance of embracing the unknown, of questioning what we think we know, and of approaching nature's mysteries with both a sense of humility and an unquenchable thirst for knowledge. For it is in the pursuit of these mysteries that we truly discover the boundless wonders of our universe and our place within it.